It's Sunday, January 8th, 2023. For All Western New York News, I'm Scott Leffler. The National Weather Service calls for mostly cloudy skies today with a high near 34 and an overnight low around 25. In news, the Niagara County Sheriff's Office Criminal Investigation Bureau is investigating a shooting that occurred Friday outside a residence on Daniels Road in the town of Wilson. According to a post on NCSO's Facebook page, the 35-year-old male victim was transported to ECMC where he was treated for a wound to his lower leg. Anyone with information on this incident is asked to contact the Niagara County Sheriff's Office at 716-438-3394 or the Criminal Investigation Bureau at 716-438-3327. Meanwhile, a 26-year-old Lockport woman and a 42-year-old Tonawanda woman were arrested with shoplifting charges in separate events. The Lockport woman, Shakira N. Pabon Anton Giorgi, was charged with petty larceny, accused of stealing from the Lockport Walmart on January 4th. The Tonawanda woman stands accused of stealing $312.93 worth of merchandise from the Buffalo store in Clarence on January 6th. Both women were issued appearance tickets. In sports, Buffalo Bills safety DeMar Hamlin, still in a Cincinnati hospital, posted to social media for the first time Saturday, expressing gratitude to fans via Facebook and Instagram. Check allwnysports.com for all the details. Of course, the Bills finish up the season today, hosting the New England Patriots. A home team victory will put the Bills at 13-3 on the season, half a game behind the Kansas City Chiefs. That'll ensure the Bills play at home until the AFC Championship game, which would either be at home if the Chiefs are knocked out by then or a neutral site if the Chiefs are still in it. Okay, that's what we got for now. Thanks for tuning in. Have a great day.